If you're doing land cover analysis, there's a really useful tool in QGIS. And you can activate it from the processing toolbox and it's called overlap analysis. You can do this different ways, but it's more complex and the overlap analysis tool is the simplest way to do this. So here's the scenario. We have a green layer here and this represents green belt land. It's kind of an urban containment policy and the green belt land is generally protected land that you can't easily build on. And the question I've got is, for example, in this area in the city of York, what proportion of the city of York and the city boundaries are in black? What proportion of York is Greenbelt land? And I want to do that for all areas of England that have Greenbelt land. So here's the Greenbelt around Cambridge and the Metropolitan Greenbelt around London. I want to know for each individual black line polygon, what proportion within that is Greenbelt land. And it's very simple with overlap analysis. So I'll double click in the tool name in the processing toolbox to activate it. My input layer here, well, that's the underlying layer, the gray layer of my map. That's the local authority boundaries, local government areas. The overlay area layers here is England Greenbelt land. So I'll click OK. And I will click on the browse button and I'm going to save this to my computer. Okay, I've browsed and I've given it a name and now I'm going to click run. When I do click run, the progress bar will go from zero to 100%. It may take a little bit of time, so I'll pause it during that time. Okay, so the tool has finished and a new layer has been added so we can close this window. Now we get a new layer and if I open the attribute table for it, and pull it into the screen, we have two new columns. One is green belt area. That's gonna be in square meters in this case because my data is in square meters. And the other column, if I sort it, that gives me a percentage figure. So in this case, we can see that the area of Tandridge has 93.87% green belt. And if I zoom to it, we can see that the coverage is in fact, as you can see, very high. So the tool is called Overlap Analysis. It may take some time to run depending on how detailed your data is, but once you do, what you will see is a data set with two new columns. One has the land area in the units of your data set, in my case, it's square meters, and another column showing you the percentage coverage. So hopefully you find that useful in your work.